Okay, Amelia. I will be right here. Okay, I'll be right here if you need me. Okay, I think he's the best. You mean someone said that, oh, you can depend on Amelia. She will always be right here. No, someone tell me. I will be right here. Okay, if you need me. I guess she said that someone said words to her that I'll be there. And, and, okay, so <laughs> did you guys get it? No, we didn't get it. Again, Dawson, louder. I guess let, uh, let someone who said uh, I'll be here if we leave it to the girl. Uh huh. Yep. And oh, that's so the best sentence she ever heard. Oh, it's the best sentence she ever heard. Yep. That a friend of hers is going to always be right there with her yep. if yep. she needs her. Okay, it's a great thing. Absolutely. Yeah, it's good. It's okay. Table two. Anybody who is 24? 24? Okay, 24. Let's keep moving on. Yes. Okay. Table two. Sounds like Constance say that uh, there's always ways for uh, for me to survive whenever uh, uh, me or others are in bad condition, and I can uh, tell myself and also uh, also tell them how to survive, how to find a way to solve the issues. So I'm someone a said, shooter. "I'm a troubleshooter." Troubleshooter. You're a troubleshooter. Yes, I'm a troubleshooter. Really? So I have full confidence to do that and also to help my friends. Okay. So someone said to you that uh, that you are so great, always trying to help yeah. other people, and you feel that was the best thing. Find a way to myself or to my friends or to survive. Okay. Yeah. It's good. It's good. Thank you. Table one. Helpful. Yeah. Because uh, in the school, I'm doing uh, something that can uh, help uh, more people. So he said he helpful. So someone said to you, you are so helpful. Mm. And you feel that was so great. Yeah. Yeah, it is great. Mm. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> no, but it's funny, some of you are not really, besides yourself, you said your husband said, many of you are not really telling me who is saying this. For example, the, one of the best things someone ever said about me is, is my mother. My mother just one day out of the blue said to me, she said, Clinton, I said, yes. She goes, I love your friends. I go, okay, why do you say that? She said, Clinton, because your friends are so good that if I left the house, if everyone left the house and your friends were in the house, I feel the house is still safe, the house is no problem. That's how your friends are. And I thought, whoa, that's a compliment to me. See, my mother's saying, my friends are so great that we could all leave the house, and my friends in the house, it's okay. So I almost cried, I said, really? No, I never thought about that, you know? But yeah, so that's a great, great compliment. It means that whoever's your friend, they better be good, because my mother's watching you. <laughs> yeah. So great, great compliment, great compliment. Okay, any other compliments that we missed that you have to share? Okay, let's move on. Number five, are you ready at number five? Are you ready? The question is, what was the best thing that you ever did for someone? Maybe you didn't know it was going to be so good for them, but it was. What was it? Share this with us. Now, are you guys ready? OK, who's speaking? Hello. Um, I divorced my first husband. <laughs> <laughs> OK. Now that's different. It turned out much better for him because his second wife was brilliant oh. and gave him, made him a very happy man, which wow. was more than I could have done. So yeah, that was the best thing I ever did for anyone. <laughs> but I think secondary to that is that her attitude about leaving her husband and having him find happiness beyond you, you are happy for that. No. I was happy too. Yeah, yeah, because many times when we say bye to our ex-lover, we almost wish them death, right? <laughs> I mean, almost, you know? But you are wishing them happiness, so you're so great. Wonderful, thank you. <laughs> Table five. Uh, the best thing I did was I uh, 
taught my students uh, over and over again. And uh, one of my students wrote a, s a little card uh -huh. to thank me, uh, uh -huh. help, help her uh, improve her lessons mm. uh, greatly. So I think that's a great compliment. Yeah, that's a great thing. Wonderful. <laughs> Helping our students is always so great. Now, table four. Just um, when I was a junior high school student, uh -huh. And uh, I was uh, very happy almost every day. Mm. And if my friends have um, problem or need my advice, I will I will I will be with them. Mm. And when I was uh, when I was graduate, they uh, a lot of people write write later to uh, uh -huh. the things of me. But I just I, I don't think too much. I just do it. Yeah. Oh, that's great! Wonderful. <laughs> Sometimes you don't know what you're doing, but then people respond uh, with letters, with letters, uh, with uh, a whole new life. I mean, you just don't know what's going to happen. Table three. <laughs> we always had a bump on table three. What's that? What's going on? Yeah. Table three. Who else? Yeah. It's that table in the corner. Okay, well, I I know, Mark, you're like, like okay, a super I'll spoke person. Somebody want, I, I was trying to get uh, somebody new to answer, but I'll answer, answer it for myself. And, uh, best thing, it was a long time ago, uh, I saw an auto accident, and I was a Boy Scout leader, and there was a lady hurt, and I stopped, and uh, the glass in the car, and I just helped her, gave her basic first aid, and. Uh, the ambulance had already been called and whatever else to comfort her, you know. I mean, she wasn't dying or anything like that, but, you know, stuff, some blood and whatever else. I knew first aid and whatever else. And then the ambulance came there, and I had a bunch of kids in the car, and they said, Mr. Cool, where did you learn all that stuff? <laughs> <laughs> you know, uh -huh. well, it's just common sense. You know? Oh, common sense for you, because you were prepared. Yeah, yeah, yeah. good, thank oh, you. Yeah. We don't know the gratefulness of people. Table two. It's the best thing that I uh, ever did that was uh, louder. I know that uh, several months uh, later from a woman. Okay. Because uh, this one time I called her because uh, her data is in Shinzo City, but the phone number, uh, number uh, was in Kilo, and I tried to find her in the in the phone. I also asked uh, the family condition of hers, and then she told me the uh, the, the fact. So I so I told her how to uh, how to fill the application forms, and also to prepare the documents. Uh, uh, then she followed that and did that, and finally she was. Uh, uh, she passed the uh, uh, investigation from the government, and, and now every month she has uh, just good uh, help from the government and also the private uh, sectors. And I feel this is uh, this very uh, uh, helpful to to her family, uh, and this kind of uh, help is much better than than any other. Uh, help from, from any other uh, units in Taiwan. So, until now. And I feel this very good. And I, I knew that uh, about many months uh, later about the result. So, that's okay. Uh, uh, 